Every year as we think of Sankalp, one of the things that we want to do is start a discourse on development issues. I think a lot of conversations around equality is happening right now, but perhaps we are not having enough conversations on equity. And the lens that we have taken to this is one of social defaults. Can we collectively think of what those thresholds are? The idea of business uh, to transform society, which was driving the discussion around GS, is essentially where probably we are heading. And I don't think so, whether you are a large corporate or a small startup, you can ignore the opportunity that the alteration of society from where it is or the inequity that society professes. If you start addressing it as a business idea, you probably have a potential to build that company that would not only transform but create significant wealth and value for each one of the stakeholders. We created the report, Better Business, Better Wealth. It shows that the SDGs represent a $12 trillion opportunity and actually can create 380 million new jobs. Now, if we seize this opportunity, we can help harness markets and all the financial, human and innovative capital they represent to deliver not only exceptional growth, but also help our economies to transition to a low carbon, inclusive and healthier world that we want for all. I had a dream, $100 million dream, to creating a fund for women. But no more. You know why? Because my dream just has come reality. If the wealth is not achieved through the right way of doing things, then that wealth cannot last. And that is why it's so important for us to make sure the effort to merge Longo and Soroban, which appears to be so far apart. When you get the right combination of will, imagination and invention, and catch the imagination of the owners of capital, you can make these sectors grow in a very exciting, rapid way. Impact investment organizations, impact investment funds, are a superb way for many of us who will never find the time to do this ourselves to support these initiatives so that this can be much more effective and can also be spread across much more rapidly than it otherwise could be. If we talk of uh, healthcare, I am personally aware of a very complex oncology treatment center in India where the capital doesn't have to be really very patient they would start making money at the end of third year. My sense would be to start something where I create a platform for maybe 300, 400 entrepreneurs who can spread a NEPRA kind of a model all across the country and probably take away 80% away from the landfills to productive use either in the waste to oil segment or waste to energy segment or cradle to cradle segment which plastic is all about. It's people by employment increase incomes and buy things and so they add up to GDP. So to increase GDP you've got to create opportunities for people to go. Today when we go to markets and buy organic vegetables, they just market it as organic mostly, but unfortunately a large percentage of that is not really organic. So how do we really solve this? So trust and traceability is the big issue that we are trying to solve here.